All right, go. <laughs> What's good, Click? Queen David, Pen Click Prime Minister. Happy Thanksgiving. During this time of sharing food and counting our blessings, I want to share with y'all an early concept we shot back in 2018 that mixed both food and poetry in a series we plan to call Hot Pepper Poetry. By the way, if you want to see more fun poetry content, be sure to subscribe to our channel and follow us on Instagram as well. All right, so the idea of hot pepper poetry was that we'd get two poets and have them slam head to head over three rounds. Sounds familiar? Yeah. But at the top of each round, they eat a spicy pepper. So each round, it would get spicier, spicier. Imagine that in the first round, they eat a jalapeno. Second round, they eat a serrano. In the third round, they're sweating and ready to eat a habanero. Yeah. The poets would eat their pepper, recite their poem, and then, if they were both good, move on to the next round. If a poet grabbed for the mercy milk, they'd get disqualified. This all sounds very simple, but as you'll soon see in our test footage, hearing poets rush through poems while they're writhing in pain wasn't exactly the best way to experience poetry, but it is a lot of fun to watch. So without much further ado, I present to you Pen Click's test of hot pepper poetry. Once was a man from Tibet who couldn't find a cigarette, so he smoked all his socks and got chicken pox and had to go to the vet. Woo! There was a young lady of Lynn who was so excessively thin that when she essayed to drink lemonade, she slipped through the straw and fell in. Oh, God. Oh, uh, uh, you gotta finish it. And fell in. What? I missed. There right. once was a man named Bryce who had a nasty head full of lice. He said, if I eat them, then I'll have the, I'll have beat them. And besides, they taste very nice. Oh, God. Fire. Oh. <laughs> I met her in a chat, she was neat. Her photo was pretty petite. We met for a meal, I saw her for real. I screamed and then ran down the street. Woo! No. Oh. <laughs> I, 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 no! 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 Oh, what? Oh, what? What? I'm not doing that. Are you kidding me? <laughs> oh my god. Please don't spill on the carpet. Wow. Winner! Are we done? Oh. Yeah. All right, cool. Big ups to my homies Seth Garns and Christian Barker for being our fiery test subjects. We immediately went to McDonald's afterwards and stuffed their mouths with fries because the milk was not cutting it to take out the spice. As for hot pepper poetry, there's a ton of logistical issues that need to be reworked that we haven't quite figured out. Like for example, you know, what if they both make it to the end or what if they have different spice tolerances or one of, one of them throws up? Like, don't really know what to do or how to adjust that. But if you enjoyed hot pepper poetry, let us know in the comments and who knows, maybe we'll rework it and bring it back for 2021. Thank you, Click, for watching and supporting us all throughout 2020. Stay safe out there, and if you liked this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up, share it with a friend, and we'll see you online. Yeah!